Developers want confidence in the code they are shipping. But there are so many influences like third-party updates and team members that make that a really hard problem to solve. As your product scales, it becomes mission critical that you're able to ship without having anything break in production. Does that sound familiar to you? Here at CircleCI, we manage change so software teams can innovate faster. We help elite engineering teams all across the globe build and ship high quality software that delights their users. CircleCI is the best CI/CD tool on the market for teams who are looking to accelerate with confidence and innovate faster. Whether you have a team of two or 20,000, you'll enjoy rich feature functionalities that meet your needs at any point in your development cycles. CircleCI is the easiest CI/CD to learn. If you're looking to accelerate, optimize, and continuously improve your software delivery, sign up for CircleCI today. Hey everyone, I'm Mario Falland, a service delivery architect at Kubernetes. We are all about making Kubernetes as easy as possible for you. Kubernetes is a powerful solution and becoming the de facto industry standard in the world. However, running Kubernetes at scale gets really messy really fast. Because of this, we built Kubernetes Kubernetes Platform or KKP. It's designed from ground up to handle massive multi-cluster deployments across any environment you throw at it. We also have an additional tool in place for handling a single cluster. It's called Cube One. It's an open source tool to manage the life cycle of a cluster running in various environments. The newest addition to the Kubernetes family is KubeLB. It's a multi-tenant load balancer solution that takes the Kubernetes principles to its core and integrates natively. We are not about only tools and products. The Kubernetes team lives and breathes open source. We are involved in many CNCF projects like KCP, KubeWord, KDS, GPT, and of course Kubernetes itself. There we are the number one contributor in Europe. So if you are wrestling with the Kubernetes complexity, you should seriously check out what we are doing at kubernetes.com or directly chat with me or our team at booth L11 at kubecom. See you there. Hey everyone, I'm Michael Cade and I'm the field CTO at Veeam Software looking after all things cloud and cloud native. Veeam has the ability to protect many platforms ranging from virtualization, cloud-based workloads, including Kubernetes. Veeam Kasten is focused on data within the cloud native space. As we have seen over the last few years, the Kubernetes adoption has grown significantly. Along with this, we have seen organizations trust the platform to also run their data services. Databases being the top deployed container image on the Kubernetes platform, according to the latest Datadog report. With that in mind, we have to consider what this means for data protection, as well as data mobility. These data services need to be protected, but they have to be protected in a consistent fashion, ensuring we can recover the whole thing when those bad things happen. There is also, or there also might be a requirement to move these applications and data be it a migration or just to take advantage of certain features and functionality maybe in a specific public cloud to leverage that data, for example. Another area is that not all state lives in the Kubernetes cluster. Sometimes we have to consider the app traverses outside of that cluster and we have to consider that when it comes to protection. An example of this might be Amazon RDS. Kasten also plays a part in the security of that data from enabling guardrails with projects such as Kyverno and OPA to store in those backups in an immutable location, such as Amazon S3 or any S3 compatible storage. As we see, Kubernetes as a control plane grow and it extend outside of container orchestration. I'm excited by the new operators to enable data services, as well as projects like Kubevert, where you can run virtual machines on top of Kubernetes. We can protect these today with Kasten and we have customers making that transition. To get started, we have a free five worker node community license or edition, which is fully functional and it gets your hands on with that. We also have a CNCF donated project called Canister. Thank you. Bonjour tout le monde, je m'appelle John Bristow. Hello everyone, my name is John Bristow. I'm the community director for Octopus Deploy and I want to invite you to our booth at KubeCon Cloud Native Con Europe 2024. We will be in booth G26. We will be next to our friends CodeFresh in G28. You can't miss us. We're the ones with the big Octopus logo. If you want to find out more about Octopus, you can visit us at octopus.com. There you can download a free trial for our on-premise or cloud solution. Octopus is a solution that allows you to do deployments to a variety of targets, including Kubernetes, in a safe and reliable manner. 
If you're at KubeCon, we would love to have a chat with you. Please feel free to drop by our booth. We're giving away stickers. We're giving away t-shirts. We would love to chat with you, show you a demo of Octopus, allow you to kick the tires, see how it works, um, and ask any questions you have of our various folks that will be there. Again, we're looking forward to seeing you at KubeCon. Please feel free to drop by our booth, G26. And if you want to find out more in the meantime, visit our website at octopus.com. Until next time, we'll see you there. A bientôt.